Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Sun Sasha. Today we will see how to crochet this spike stitch. As usual, we will be starting with the slip knot. Here I make my slip knot. After slip knot, make as many as uh, chain crochet stitches you want, whatever your project is. So I am making for tutorial purpose, so I am just taking few stitches. You take as per your wish, as, uh, how big a project you are making. Okay. Here I am done with my chain crochet stitches. Okay. Now we will skip the stitch which is just next to the uh, current loop. And a stitch after that we will make, we will go on making one single crochet stitch in each single stitch. Sorry for background noise, my kid is playing. Okay, so we'll make one single crochet stitch in each single stitch. So, uh, this we have to do till end of the row. So I'll just complete this and I'll show you. So any of you want to refer tutorial video for single crochet stitch, link is already there in description. So you can refer that link. It is quite slow and easy demonstration is given. Now see, I'm done with the last stitch. So after that, we will just make a chain crochet stitch and we will turn our work. Okay. Now, starting from first stitch itself. Now after this, every row we will start from the first stitch. From first stitch itself, we will again uh, make one complete row in which one single crochet in each single stitch. Just remember, one single crochet in each single stitch. So I'll just uh, do it till the end of the uh, row and I'll show you. See, I am done with the last stitch. Now, I will uh, be changing color. Okay. To change color, keep two loops on your needle. Okay. And grab the yarn, new yarn and pull through from those two loops at once. And make a chain crochet stitch. Okay. This is how you add new yarn to your work. Okay. After that chain crochet stitch, just turn your work as you did earlier. And again, starting from first stitch. We will make a complete row in which one single crochet stitch in each single stitch. Basically, we are making four rows. So, after this following same pattern, we will make one more row of that color. So, two color, uh, two rows of one color and two rows of uh, second color. Okay. So, I'll just complete these two rows and I'll show you. Okay, see, I'm done with two colors. Okay, now we are going to repeat these two uh, colors after every two rows. Okay, now we will come back to first color. So, we will grab a yarn, pull through from two loops and make a chain crochet stitch and turn our work. For ending, this process is same once you change the color. Or if you don't change the color, just make a chain crochet stitch and turn it. See, here we are done. Now, in first stitch, we will make a single crochet stitch. In first stitch itself, we will make a single crochet stitch. Okay. Now, see, now, here is the trick. Now, in second stitch, we will leave that upper stitch and we will come to the same color stitch, which is two rows below. See, we will leave upper stitch, we will leave down one also and the same color stitch that is coming down. From there, we will make a single crochet stitch uh, you need to pull your yarn more because we need uh, larger loops see so we need to pull your I pull our yarn more uh, and uh, then uh, uh, may, we will in next stitch we will uh, make a single crochet stitch again in the, the same color yarn stitch next stitch we will take from there and make a single crochet stitch and see, you need to pull your yarn more. So the spikes are seen good and long. Then again next stitch. Go on skipping stitches which are be, uh, coming behind that spike. Okay. We don't have to take those stitches. We have to take next stitch. Only one stitch we are taking from that second color. And uh, one stitch we are taking from the same color yarn. Okay, so we are just taking long single crochet stitches. 
see we will leave that stitch and in next stitch we will make a single crochet stitch okay and next stitch we will make a, that spike and for that we will go down to that color uh, yarn and from there we will make a single crochet stitch so like same you have to do uh, till the end of the row so i'll just uh, i'm showing you slow demonstration i'll just complete this row and i'll show you now see i'm done with the last stitch okay so uh, we are going to make one row of single crochet stitch so we will just make a chain crochet stitch and turn up now starting from first stitch we will just make a one single crochet stitch in each single stitch so we are making a row of single crochet stitches so i'll just complete it till the end of the row and i'll show you See now we are done with two rows in one column. Now we will switch to our second column. So we will keep two loops on the needle. Pull the yarn from those two loops. Make a chain crochet stitch. Okay. Now, now see in that previous color we first made a single crochet stitch and then we made that spike stitch. So now we will start with the spike stitch. So we will make a single crochet stitch from the same color. So that is two row below. See, from this stitch, from same color stitch, we will make a. You need to pull it as long as you can. So we get that spike good. In next stitch, we will make a single crochet stitch. Okay. Then again, we will come down. From same color stitch, we will make a single crochet stitch. Pull that yarn as longer as you can. Then in next stitch. Again, a single crochet stitch. Same thing, same thing. You have to do what you have done earlier. Same thing you have to do uh, till end of the row. Only one row we start first with a single crochet stitch and a second stitch with that spike. So another color we will start with the spike and then a single crochet stitch. Okay, I'll complete this row and after this row we will just make a chain crochet stitch turn our work and make one single crochet stitch in each single stitch so it's like basically we are going to follow these four uh, rows all over a pattern row number five six seven and eight okay you have to go on repeating these four rows all over the pattern as bigger as you make just remember this thing starting to are the uh, normal single crochet stitches row and, uh, uh, starting four rows are uh, normal single crochet stitches row then from four sorry fifth row sixth row seventh row and eighth row a uh, pattern comes okay so we're basically going to follow this four rows all around so i'll just make some seven uh, some more rows so that you will get a better idea of the design how it looks okay i'll just show you Now see this is how a crochet spike stitch or spike crochet stitch looks like. So if you have liked the video please like, comment, share and please if you have not subscribed my youtube channel Sansasha I will request you to please please subscribe Sansasha youtube channel and those who have already subscribed thanks a lot thank you so much and please uh, keep on watching as I'm coming up with lots and lots of new videos lots of new stitches and as you can see all my tutorial are with written notes so you will get it in Hindi also so please please subscribe Sansasha YouTube channel and uh, please let me know whether you have tried if any uh, uh, whether you have liked so please like comment share and subscribe Sansasha thank you thanks for watching my video please like and subscribe thank you